everyone, I am going to start a new series called Cook With Me. Don't have my uh, tripod yet, so I'm holding my my phone and, uh-oh, memory's getting low. So what we're going to start with is something delicious. And guess what it is? It is biscuits. <laughs> Don't worry, my Cook With Me will be much more interesting. I just thought this would be a funny way to introduce it. I haven't had one of these in a long time. You know how you gotta hit the can or something? What's this say? Let's read it. Uh, I think it's upside down. It says, uh, I can't see, oh, peel in direction of arrow to remove label. Press spoon at seam, twist can to open. Oh, that's different. You don't hit it anymore. Wow, it's been a while since I had one of these. So let's see. Something in the arrow of the what? What's it say now? Okay. So I'm going to do with one hand. Let's see. Can't stop the phone because, you know, you can't see me doing it because, hold on. Okay, as you see so far, I don't know with one hand if it's going to continue to do this. Kind of hard to do with one hand. Yeah, I used to hit these. I hated them. I remember when I was little. I would get so scared. I turn my mom to do it. She wouldn't let me do it. She wouldn't let me do a lot of things. But that's that. So now we got to find a seam. Whoops, 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 whoops. I'm going to grab the spoon. I may as well show you this while I got the spoon. This is so good. We found it at the store the other day. It is Asiago Artichoke, maybe dip. I don't know what it's called. It's so good. When you melt it down, the artichokes, I can't eat. They're too hard. But I cut it up and smush it with a fork. And Polly and I love it. I don't eat a lot because of my cholesterol, but oh my gosh, it's so good. But we're going to use this spoon to try to open this in the seam. And I'm probably going to yell, so be careful because it's probably going to scare me. Let's see. Where's the seam? There's the seam. Let's see. Uh, ah! <laughs> I warned you. <laughs> so then you open it up. Oh, I wish I had a tripod. You can't see me opening it up. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, so basically I got it open. And then we opened the rest of the way. Sorry. Oh my gosh. It's like you're on a roller coaster ride. Hold on a minute. Okay, so I put them in here so it's easier because one hand if you can't do it. So it says put them touching. You know, this is a store brand. Obviously the name brand, they're easier to come apart, but... That's okay. These taste good. Pretty, pretty tiny. That's the difference between a brand name and a store name. See, they don't come apart that good. Ugh, this is so hard. Holding the phone, trying to do this. One, two, three. I think there's ten of them in there. So hold on. And like magic, they're there. Oh my gosh, something fell. So here they are. And guess what? I ripped off the thing and didn't read how long. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to put them in the oven at 400 degrees. I think it said 10 to 13 minutes. So what I'll do is I'll put it for 9 and check it. Thing is, this is a pan made for 9. But I fit them somehow. Somehow, some way. There's always a way. Doesn't have to be perfect. Nothing's perfect in this world. So here we go. Just to be sure, it says how to bake. Preheat oven to 400. Separate into 10 biscuits onto ungreased. Well, lucky it wasn't ungreased. <laughs> Never mean that. Baking sheet bake 10 to 13 minutes. So I'm going to start on 9 and see what happens. It's one minute. A little over one minute left. Probably only need another minute or two. By the way, in the interim, we warm this up. What I showed you, look how this one's warmed up. It's in the microwave for like 20 seconds. Club cracker crackers. I had these other ones. 
they used to melt in my mouth, but I think maybe they're kind of, I think I left them open when we got hard. Well, these aren't melting either. I think I'm just going to eat this with a spoon. It takes too long to melt. But this is so good. I took the artichoke pieces out of mine because there's no way I could chew them. It is so delicious. So if you have a Wegmans, look for it. It's really good. Okay, countdown. I had to put it. I put it for another two minutes. I should really check on it. Actually, I might need another nine, another minute. So this will be eleven minutes. It says ten to thirteen. So I'll see. Okay, so that was eleven minutes, and they're not quite as brown. So I think another half a minute. Well, that will be 12 minutes. I don't know. It might have to be the whole 13 minutes. Yep, it took the whole 13 minutes. Isn't that pretty? It like, makes a little decoration. So you let them sit for two to three minutes, and then they're ready to enjoy. So don't forget to subscribe, like, hit the notification bell, share, sharing is caring. Don't forget to pay forward. Feels good in your heart, Polly's heart, and mine. Go help someone if you can, even if it's just a phone call. And uh, I hope you join enjoying my enjoyed my first cook with me very simple but the other ones will be more complicated bye for now